motivation, the general desire or willingness of someone to do something. Northwest Florida baseball team could be described as such. Motivated to work hard. Work on three, one, two, three, one. Motivated to be good teammates. But most of all, they were motivated to succeed. It's me, Fitz, Kyle Fitzgerald. I'm from uh, Burfield, Illinois, and uh, I'm a sophomore outfielder. We had high expectations. It's always, you know, championship, championship thoughts and goals. Everybody loved everybody. The top of the roster, the bottom of the roster, everyone would play for each other and just built bonds and just such a love and passion from the, for the game translated with each other. It was just awesome how everyone got along. It was something that I looked forward to every single day, being able to show up and practice with everybody. And, uh, you know, I really don't know what I'm going to do without it. After an amazing season, the Raiders finished 40-10 and 10 and were the Panhandle Conference champions for the first time since 2011. Eyeing a national championship, they traveled southeast to Lakeland for the first stop in their journey for domination. The money on my mind, a great deal of it will fix me all I've ever desired. We're out here at the state tournament, bottom three. Uh, you know, it's looking pretty good for the Raiders right now. Uh, Boz found a good flow on the mound. You know, their guy's been a little erratic, offense got going, big home run by JT, and uh, let's keep this thing going here. They're gonna have to bleed this off, that kid oh, sucks, no. Funk. <laughs> Raiders were on a roll. They soon found themselves facing off against a very familiar opponent. I knew the whole time we had to go through Chipola. Chipola's definitely the toughest team there. Northwest Florida faced Chipola College six times in the regular season and managed to split the series three to three. Chipola on the third day, two and zero. You know, really the game that kind of deciphers the entire tournament. You look back on it, you don't you don't know what you'd do different, but uh, you know they they just got us that time. That game would have been huge for us, but it didn't go our way, and there was no panic. There was no like, oh, we're out of this. It was mentally tolling, but I mean we were capable of doing it, and it it was in it was within our reach. So we dropped the Chipola game. We come back. We play uh, Miami Dade. Uh, we beat Miami Dade. We make a you know a final day. We become down to the last two teams, us and Chipola. Uh, first game, you know, we, we fight again. Kelch starts. He gives us two good innings. I come in and give us a couple more crappy innings. Uh, and then Stevens takes it and runs with it again. Um, gives us until the ninth inning. And, you know, JT does what JT does. Yeah! Oh!
JT hit a walk off bomb. I said, "Let's go." He picked me up. I'm ready. I'm hyped, baby. We won. We got one more game. I mean, it's been a long week. It's been a tough ride. Like the whole season's coming down to one game against a team we've been rivals for the last couple of years, and we played them nine times on the year. It was like a storybook type of ending, you know. Unfortunately, not every story has a happy ending. Um, I wasn't expecting to lose. I told everyone back home, pan, uh, parents and everything, like, we're not going to lose. Like, there's no way. Like, I just didn't want to, I didn't want to, you know, believe it because this is, like, the best team I've ever played for. I wasn't able to give up that, you know, and it's just, I was just sat in the dugout after the game and I just, I didn't want to think about anything. I just didn't want to think about just, you know, not playing another game with these guys. It was just not, not something I thought about what, what happened. Day one, we, we all knew we were going to go to the World Series, like we all believed it. And then to have it happen in that way, it was really tough. We are a championship caliber team and, and that's something I'll always look back on and, and uh, you know, smile about. We were good because of each other making each other good. I mean, it's been a hell of a ride. And, uh, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't change anything about it. I mean, it's, it's life, though, you know. Life's kind of sad. It wasn't because of a lack of motivation. In order for there to be winners, there have to be losers. That does not mean that everything that we have done throughout the year was for naught. From August to May, we left it all on the field every single day, and it shows. Find a group of people who challenge and inspire you. Spend a lot of time with them, and it will change your life. We are more than just teammates. We are a family.